In the bustling port city of Genoa in the early 15th century, a financial institution was born that would set the stage for the modern banking world. The Banco de San Giorgio, founded in 1407, was not just an ordinary bank. It was a groundbreaking financial powerhouse that would leave an indelible mark on the evolution of banking. This is the captivating tale of its birth and the profound influence it has had on the modern financial landscape. The birth of Banco de San Giorgio. Picture Genoa in the 14th century, a maritime powerhouse, a city engaged in extensive trade across the Mediterranean. The city's prosperity and its vital role in international commerce demanded a reliable financial institution to manage its burgeoning finances and support its maritime endeavors. On his historic day, March 10, 1407, a group of forward-thinking Genoese noblemen and merchants gathered with a vision in mind. To establish the Banco di San Giorgio, named in honor of the city's patron saint, St. George. This institution was poised to become a revolutionary force in the world of finance. Revolutionary Banking Practices The Banco de San Giorgio introduced groundbreaking concepts that would form the bedrock of modern banking. Deposits and Accounts The bank offered a secure place for individuals and entities to deposit their funds. Account holders received written records of their deposits, which could be transferred or used as a form of payment, a precursor to modern bank accounts. Liquidity Management With astute financial management, the bank balanced its reserves by accepting deposits, issuing loans, and investing in trade ventures. It rapidly earned a reputation for stability. Innovative Bond Issuance To raise capital for the needs of the Republic, the bank pioneered the issuance of bonds. These bonds were backed by various revenue streams, such as customs, duties, and taxes, a practice mirroring the modern financial instruments used today. International Trade Financing The bank played a pivotal role in financing and facilitating international trade, a precursor to the comprehensive trade finance services offered by contemporary banks. Lending and Credit Banco de San Giorgio extended credit to the Republic and funded maritime expeditions, an early version of the loans provided by banks to governments and businesses today. Enduring Legacy on Modern Banking The Banco de San Giorgio's legacy stretches across centuries, its influence profoundly felt in modern banking. Banking Infrastructure the bank's model of establishing branches and providing written account statements laid the foundation for today's banking infrastructure, including the development of branch networks and online banking. Risk Management Its innovative use of bonds as a financial instrument demonstrated the concept of risk diversification, an essential practice in contemporary finance. Trade Finance the bank's role in supporting international trade paved the way for the expansive trade finance solutions offered by banks worldwide. Banking Regulation The Banco de San Giorgio's pioneering practices and the challenges it faced led to the development of early banking regulations, setting a precedent for modern banking oversight. In conclusion, the founding of the Banco de San Giorgio in 1407 was a defining moment in banking history. Its innovative practices and enduring legacy continue to shape the modern financial landscape. The bank's commitment to stability, the introduction of written records and accounts, its support for international trade and credits, all laid the groundwork for sophisticated banking systems we rely on today. It stands as a testament to the enduring impact of visionary financial institutions throughout history, whose echoes resonate through the corridors of modern banking.